For Newsy, I'm Lauren Zima. A new exhibit at the Richard Nixon Presidential Library contains newly declassified documents that are making waves, with one letter in particular revealing what looks like a surprising friendship between Nixon and President Bill Clinton. After Clinton won the election to the White House in 1992, Nixon sent him a congratulatory note saying, The strongest steel must pass through the hottest fire. In enduring that ordeal, you have demonstrated that you have the character to lead. The pair were separated by party lines, more than 30 years in age, and wildly different personalities. But according to CBS News, that didn't stop them from continuing to work together. Over the next two years, Nixon offered Clinton his expertise on foreign affairs and in 1994 made his last overseas trip to Russia and the Ukraine. When Nixon died a few months later, it was Clinton who eulogized him. During that eulogy, Clinton urged people not to judge Nixon on the messy end to his career after the Watergate scandal, but instead on his entire life. Clinton was, of course, impeached himself by the House following allegations of perjury and obstruction of justice regarding his affair with White House intern Monica Lewinsky. He was acquitted by the Senate. For Newsy, I'm Lauren Zima.